Good morning, Kingsley Community. Pastor Colleen Wehrman here coming to you with another daily devotion for Wednesday morning, January 4th, 2023. Again, using all the best from Dr. David Jeremiah. A Grand Irony is today's uh, devotional title, and it comes from our scripture reading, Proverbs 18, verse 24. A man who has friends must himself be friendly, <laughs> but there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. Our technology has ellipsed our psychology. Is it a coincidence or just a kind of grand irony that loneliness has spiked just as our media became social, our technology became personal, and our machines learned to recognize our faces? Andy Crouch asked that question in his book, The Life We're Looking For. Every morning, millions of people check their phones and social media, then go into their day with little true human interaction. They retire at night after checking their phones again and fall to sleep with a hunger in their souls for love and significance. Is that you? We all need to improve the craft of cultivating our friendships. To whom can we be friendly today? But remember, there's also a divine friend who sticks closer than a brother. <clears throat> when you feel no one cares about you, remember God loved you before you were born. Put technology and psychology aside for a moment to offer a toxology, doxology of praise to him. So in other words, spend some time with God in the morning before you get on your social media. And remember who is a friend who sticks with you closer than a brother, and that's God. God will always be with you. God doesn't go anywhere. Um, and God um, is always available. Even when you're checking your phones and you forget about him, he's still there. <laughs> So uh, Thomas Ken writes, praise God from whom all blessings flow. Praise him, all creatures here below. That's a doxology, him. Praise him above, ye heavenly host. Praise Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. So Thomas Crouch, his book is The Life We're Looking For. That might be a good book to read. And then we're to read the prophet Jeremiah, chapter 31, verses 1 through 6. So the grand irony is we have become more... Um, attached, you know, with technology. You know, you can talk to someone in Australia. Um, you can, you know, FaceTime someone in Indonesia. Uh, you can, you know, reach people via email, Twitter, tweets. You know, we have the world at our fingertips, and yet we've become more lonely and more um, uh, anxiety ridden than ever before. So it might have something to do with the technology. So sometimes just get away from the technology and go to God, spend time with God first. Um, that's all I got for today. So I hope you're having a good day and I will see you back here tomorrow and we'll do another daily devotion from, these are free, all the best turning points, Dr. David Jeremiah. It's a magazine and devotional. So, um, with all kinds of little articles in here. And then you get your daily devotionals like that. So, you know, whatever. It's free. I like that. <laughs> all right. Have a good day. Stay cool.